What's up, booze? What it do? What it do? Hey, 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 and welcome to A. Nicole Tarot. I am your girl, A. Nicole. Mm, not a quiet night. Somebody going through the going through. But I'm your girl, A. Nicole, and I'm here to do <laughs> a twin flame reading. Um, so come on in. Um, this is uh, for the twin flame you have... Um, on your mind, whether you are together, separated, we will see what the hell is going on. I only want you all to take what resonates, leave the rest behind, okay? Um, I'm tapping into the general collective, not just yours, so only take what resonates, okay? If you want to schedule a personal reading with me, I will leave my information in the description below, okay? Thank you all to my booze who have been scheduling their personal readings. And their birth chart and human de 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 design analysis. I appreciate you all tremendously. Shout out to my booze um, who have been hitting up my tip jar. You know, I really appreciate you all. Um, and thank you all for those of you who like the video, who comment, who share the video, whatever level, whatever tier, whatever token. I appreciate it all. Okay. Uh, Trick Daddy, can you get off my stand? Don't look at me like that. Okay. So um, let's get into this reading and see what do we have? What, what, are, what is your twin wanting to say to you? I want out. Oh, God. They want out. So they, your twin could be dealing with somebody. They could be in a relationship. They could be in a committed relationship with someone. They could be married. You know, they could. Somebody could have had a baby. I, you, look, they stand for the kids. You look. All this other crazy shit. Look at here. <laughs> I got divorced when my son was five years old. Fuck the bullshit. Stay for the kids, my fucking ass. I got to put me first, Lucius. Okay? Uh-uh, 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 uh-uh. So, I mean, when people say that, I'd be like, I, I guess. Uh-uh, uh-uh. I, 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 I had to beat them charges like Rocky. Okay, I, I I had to come out of the matrix. Mm 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 mm. -mm. I, I don't know how people do that, but this person wants out. I feel like with this, I want out. Your person is quote unquote taken. Your person is dealing with someone. I, I dare I say married, sexual desire. Your person is desiring you sexually. Mm hmm. Yeah, your person wants to feel the fire. Okay, I need to figure myself out. Your person needs to figure some things out, but they can't take it anymore, baby. They want out. They feeling like a dungeon dragon. Okay, they may can't take it anymore with their desire, their sexual desire for you as well. Like, you know, they could be conflicted about something. That's why they need to take some time and figure some things out. They just need time to see where they want to be, but they want to know also, is it over? Is this really over? Are you really quitting them? Are you really just not, you know, dealing with them anymore? Emotions overwhelm me. So this person, this is telling me that your person could be very emotionally unavailable or may not be good with expressing their emotions, telling you how they feel. Hmm. It could be very sexual, but when it comes to expressing emotions, communicating, <sighs> being emotionally present it's like yeah they didn't left the building elvis has left the building thank you spirit what else do we have spirit thank you spirit Ooh, okay i am scared of rejection yeah your person could have some rejection issues your person could even feel like and this may not be true but your person may even feel like one day you're just going to quit them you're just going to reject them. And also with this, I'm scared of rejection. This could also talk about this person trying to circle the block and talk to you. We are in Mercury retrograde. Your person may want to reach out to you, especially if you all are just not talking. You're not on good terms, but they're afraid that you're going to reject them because remember, they're emotionally prideful. You know, like they don't like, they're not comfortable showing their emotions. They're not comfortable expressing their emotions, you know, being vulnerable. You know, and then on top of that, like, you may reject them. Why do I feel so lost? They feel so lost because they're outside of the covenant of a connection with you. You know, they've stepped out of that, 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 
that fire that you all had, like you, a lot of you have withdrawn, you've pulled your energy back, you know, so they're not under that, that covenant of divinity anymore. Hmm. What else, spirit? Thank you for that. I will get to it. Let me get through the shuffle. Thank you for that, spirit, and that. Sheesh. Hold on. I feel lonely. I'm, baby, your person is going through the motherfucking going through. They, they feel lonely, don't they? Even if they're with somebody, I'm telling you. I don't give a fuck if they go in and lay down with somebody every night. Okay? They, 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 they want to come and lay their head on your pillow. And just relax, okay? I like you and your eyes, they all know. They can always tell you why you're my pillow. Okay? They can always. They can always. They can always. And just relax. I'm trying to tell you, sex with you, that's sexual desire, baby. That's what they be thinking about. But it's real, it's real hot. They be feeling that fire. Okay, you be putting it on them. Like you all, because you all are twin flames. So that passion is just, whew. But they saying, don't wait for them, please. Because their emotions is overwhelming them. They feel like you're going to reject them. Do not wait for them. And please don't wait for them. Please get out here and live your life. What I tell you? The passion is too much. Why can't I tell you the truth? And why can't they tell you the truth? Because they're afraid of rejection. And they are in some sort of hell. They can't take it anymore because they love you. They feel this magnetic attraction to you. They feel lost without you. Okay? They on that Robin sick. Okay? Um, but at the same time, in the meantime, in between time, like emotions overwhelm them. They don't have what it takes to give you what you need. They're not on your level. You know, they don't know where to start. They're afraid of rejection. They can't tell you the truth. They, they still can't be honest with you. The passion is too much. The way I have treated you was wrong. Mm, so this person could have definitely mishandled you. I wish I could understand you. Mm. So you could be like someone they've never met before. So they don't know your blueprint. They've never met anyone like you before. So of course they're going to mishandle you. They've never handled someone like you. And they just don't understand you. The passion I feel is overwhelming. I don't know how to handle this. Child, y'all put it on them. I'm telling you, like, I'm feeling a lot of fire and desire, a lot of passion, passion. It hurts so much. Like, this really fucks this person up to be in separation from you. Like, this really hurts. What hurts the most is letting go. Okay, I just want you to know that I love you so. I know things are different now. You've gone and settled down. I thought for sure you'd always wait for me. I love that song by Monica. Oh, look, Trick Daddy that came back. Yeah, the dog thought he was going to be able to come back. Okay, huh, Tricky Dicks? He thought he was going to come back like you. You've triggered this person. They can't understand you, but you get under their skin. Mm. This hurts them so much. They know that they can't make, they can't make you happy. Because they not happy. Let's just call it a buck. They can't make you happy because they not fucking happy. The hell? Hmm. What you think, Tricky? Tail wagging. He said, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. Let me pull some more. Watch out, Tricky Dicks. One second, Tricky. Tricky. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. Trick was licking my elbow. Watch out. Trick Daddy. Come on. Okay, Spirit. What else we got? I wish I could be fully honest with you. Why can't I tell you the truth? So yeah, this person is a liar and a court testifier. Mm. I want to be different. I'm afraid to lose you. That's why this person is asking if this is over. They are afraid to lose you because this shit is just over. I'm overwhelmed right now. I'm over here looking like I'm sitting at the bar. You know, thinking about how I'm going to pay my mortgage. Whew. Yeah, but this person is really overwhelmed. Like, I feel like this person is, is dealing with some sort of special hell. They got a lot of shadow work. It's like they want, they desire this thing with you, 
but that road towards it, it's, it overwhelms them. They know that they're, they're going to have some sort of a mass transformation, you know, to get to have you the way they want you. And that is very scary to them. That's very overwhelming to them. That's a lot of work that they have to do that they weren't banking on, you know, huh, but you put it on them and, and they miss that. I mean, even if they are dealing with somebody, they're not you. Mm-mm. They're not you at all. Mm-mm. No. Not if their best day and your worst day fell on the same day. You were right and they were wrong. There's the, you may have told this person something. Like you're going to see or, you know, you may have warned them about something, you know, prophesy something to them and they're seeing that you were right you were right how could you ever forgive the mess i made my god what the hell went on what mess did they make tell me in the comments for research purposes of course research purposes but yeah tell me in the comments what mess did they make i want out somebody may have got someone pregnant and they they put they somebody did something and now they feel stuck in the decisions, it is dark without you. I'm trying to tell you, your person is lost without you. Like that Robin Thicke. Okay? Like they are they are lost without you. Like they are out here wandering without you. I mean, that's that twin flame energy. You, you're on this person's mind a lot. You probably can feel it. You're on this person's mind a lot. Like they just... Then now they're asking, will this ever change? Like, will they ever heal? Will they ever get over this? And they're wondering if you ever cross their mind anytime. What I tell you, you are so different from everyone around me. What I t thank you, Spirit. Hey, I mean, I know I do this. Miss Gladys, I, yeah. I already know where I am. My credentials with this shit. But I just like when Spirit come on out and say what I had already said before. You are so different from anyone around me. And I said they mishandled you because they've never handled anyone like you before. Run back the transcripts, please. You'll see it there. Mm -hmm. It's in the notes. Yeah, they've never dealt with anybody like you before. You're rare. And you're you're their twin. <sighs> That's why. And now you didn't, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't lit, lit, turn some fire on with them. You didn't flame them out. Okay, you didn't turn the passion up. And then you didn't pull back. You're not giving them that no more, baby. They're going through them withdrawals. Okay. Thank you, Spirit. If the messages are resonating for you, I ask that you please give the video a thumbs up. It really helps the channel and the algorithm. And it makes your girl so happy. Thank you, Spirit, for that. I will return. I think I saw two flip out. Yep. If I could go back in time, I would handle us differently. And I said they mishandled you because they've never handled someone like you before. Yeah, something about the way they handled you. But they say if they could turn back time, if they could find a way, okay, they take back all the words that they told you and you stay. Okay. Let me see. I thought I saw something else flip over. Maybe not. I just want to make sure I get all of y'all's messages to y'all. Because I don't want no trouble. But what I tell you, I cry at night. And remember, this came out and when, I, when I first started. This was the first card that came out. And I put it back in the deck. And Spirit would say, ah, this person be crying like a bitch ass. Like a biatch at night. That night be tearing they ass up. You know, when they take that mask off and they got to deal with themselves, you know, when they take that mask off and that silence, you know, hits their ass, that darkness hits their ass. Hmm. This person be crying at night. They be doing that, that Casey and JoJo. Okay. It's been an hour since you've been gone. I'm trying to tell you, it's all too much. This person is overwhelmed. This separation, you pulling back your energy, you taking all that good sex, you taking all of that good passion, that fire, you know, just, 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 just all that magnetic energy. They can't take this and they know they fucked it up. They lied. They did all types of things. They wrote a check that they, they don't want to cash now. They don't want to pay up. But you wrote the check, baby. Now you don't want to pay up? Why? 
What happened? Hmm. Yeah. Please do what is best for your heart. This person keeps wanting, you know, they understand that you deserve better. They don't want you to wait for them. And they say, please do what's best for your heart and do it. The hell? Why would you stick around for that? I don't give a damn how overwhelmed it is. I also read the cards in here that was talking about how they hurt you. How they lied to you. How they weren't on the up and up. Okay? You don't have to be with your twin flame. Okay? And you, you can have more than one twin flame. Okay? I didn't met a few. Let's see. Anything else, spirit? Mm -hmm. You you know how many lifetimes you lived? <sighs> okay, you met the twin flame when you was in that life. Okay, what about the life before that? Okay, maybe that one act like they got some motherfucking sense when you come across that one. Keep looking, keep searching. Okay, I tell you, and I say, you look, you you had me clearly, you had me fucked up in that life, and you got me still fucked up in this life. So look. I don't got time for this shit, and I'll see you next lifetime, okay? Because you're not going to do that shit here in another lifetime when I got the fuck away from you in the last one. Absolutely not. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. You still on that bullshit, like Chicago, okay? Is it over? Your person is asking. This is the second time this came out. Your person, they want to know, is this the end? Is it really over? All this passion, all of this, like, all of this that they feel, is it still over? You just want to throw this away? You just want to let me go? You just want to walk away? Mm. They want to know. Mm. Well, what say you, boo? Is it over? What you going to tell them? What are you going to tell them? Is this over? Let's see. Thank you, spirit. I can't do this right now. I can't handle your love. What I tell you, your person is not ready for you. You're too fiery. They're attracted to your fire, but they also can't handle it. Okay? And they're going to blame you every time you burn them. They're going to blame you every time you warm their ass up a little bit too much for their liking. Please. Got the nerve to be yearning for something you can't handle. If you don't get the fuck out of my face, I don't play that shit. And I'm a fiery girl. So dudes have this push-pull with me where it's like, oh my God, I love how fiery and da 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 you are. But then that's something that be sticking their ass sometimes. And baby, you're not about the power struggle with me. And you're not about the power struggle, whatever the hell you got going on within you, with your masculine, you know, with me. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. Let me just go ahead and let you get the fuck on. Mm-hmm. 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 Did I see something flip over? Maybe not. Okay. Don't be turning. I thought so. I have to let you go to find myself. Don't be turning your fire down for nobody. Nobody. You know? Hold out or continue to look and seek those who can handle your fire, match your fire. Or just, you know, be there to uh, consume it. Take it in. You know, I got boos who love my fire. It's, 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 it's a great thing for them. But also, you know, they're powerful, you know, and they're strong men and they're masculine. So like when I be around them, baby, I be purring like a kitty cat. I don't be like none of this. Okay. I be shutting the fuck up. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you're my divine feminine. Okay. That's when I know I'm in good company. You're not trying to assert a power struggle with me. You're leading. And it's like, be a lady. Uh, and I sit the fuck back and I be a lady. Okay? So somebody going to fuck with it. Somebody going to feel with it. You ain't got to tussle this shit with nobody else. I don't do that. I don't tussle my fire. I don't tussle, you know, my magic, my intensity, my power. Hell ass. If you don't get it, y'all. No. I'm going to move on and I'm going to gravitate to someone who knows how to handle this and not mishandle it. And baby, it's lit over here. I be, I be having a good time. Okay? I be sending postcards and shit home and stuff like that. Like, I look, don't you worry about me. Okay? Nick doing good. Let's see. 
if the messages are resonating for you i ask that you please give the video a thumbs up it really helps the channel and the algorithm and it makes your girl so happy do we have anything i think it may be time to retire this deck because like my shuffling is just they've gotten too soft mm. anything else spirit Anything else for my baby booze about their twin flame? Do we want to go into the tarot? I don't know. Spirit was like, I, I think that that's that you you said what I needed you to say, man. But I still want to just flip through the tarot a few times and see if we got anything for the booze spirit. You know, I'm I'm diligent. Your person is really, 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 really in their feelings and in their head about you they think about you a lot a lot of you all like i said you can feel them thinking about you but they mule over you all a lot the past memories the the, the breakup the separation the passion like they are they are in their head a lot you know following the separation you know they may not be really socializing a lot you know kind of keeping to themselves a little bit they're miserable. That's why they say they want out. They feel like they're in some sort of hell. Some sort of purgatory. They want out. I feel like that nighttime be tearing their ass up. They be tossing and turning in that bed. Anything else, Spirit? No? Okay. Spirit say no. I'm going to leave it here. I hope these messages have brought you some clarity, some comfort, some closure, whatever it was you were looking for. I hope you found it here and then some with me. I am your girl, A. Nicole. All right, I love y'all. I'm rooting for y'all. I want the best for y'all. All right, I'm here for y'all. I want y'all to keep that head up. Y'all already know I want y'all to keep that fucking bread up. And please, please, please keep these holes stirred the fuck up so they can shut the fuck up. Okay, I'll leave my information below if you want to schedule a reading with me. Okay, a personal reading, a birth chart, human design analysis. If you want to do a life coaching session with me, I'm going to leave all of that information below. I'm your girl, Amy Nicole. I'm out. Bye.